British people celebrate some festivals, like Christmas and Easter, with the rest of Europe. But some are just British. Here's a very British festival, and a very noisy one. This is Guy Fawkes Night in Britain. On the 5th of November every year, British people remember Guy Fawkes and his plot to blow up the King and the Houses of Parliament in 1605. That's Guy Fawkes. And here he is under the Houses of Parliament. Some soldiers are arresting him and taking him away. Every November the 5th, British people burn a model of Guy Fawkes. The models are called guys. Children make them out of old clothes. There are lots of fireworks, too. What's this? It's Pancake Day. Pancake Day is in February. In some towns, there are pancake races. People throw pancakes in the air and race at the same time. And, of course, they eat lots of pancakes, too. Look at these beautiful red roses. And here's a card. Shh, let's have a look. To my darling Julie, with lots and lots of love from... And look, there isn't a name. But look at all those kisses. Why? Because today is a very romantic day. It's St. Valentine's Day. On the 14th of February, people send cards to someone they're in love with. But they don't sign the card. How do you know who it's from? You don't. You guess. Now it's October the 31st, and it's Halloween. A festival of ghosts and witches. People often have parties, and children dress up as witches. But the really important festivals in Britain are Easter and Christmas, especially Christmas. At Christmas, people put up lots of decorations. This is the Robinson's Christmas tree. They keep their presents under it until Christmas Day. People often spend Christmas with their families. On Christmas Day, they give presents to their friends and family. What's Mrs. Robinson got? Oh, how lovely. Lucky Mum. Thank you, darling. Oh, great. Poor old Dad's got four pairs of socks. In the morning, a lot of families go to church. They come back home and have a special Christmas dinner. Roast turkey, stuffing, roast potatoes and Brussels sprouts. These are crackers. You pull at each end and inside there's a little present a paper hat and a joke. Listen to this. Where can you always find a cow? In a museum. Museum. Understand? Oh, oh sorry. finish with a traditional Christmas pudding. Sometimes people put a silver coin in it. You don't eat it. It brings you good luck. After Christmas, there's the last festival of the old year, or the first one of the new year, New Year's Eve. In Scotland, they call it Hogmanay. All round the country, people have parties. And at midnight, everyone sings a traditional song, Old Lang Syne.
In Trafalgar Square in London, there's always a really big party.